Welcome back to Love, Lies, and Lace Friends. Happy New Year. Happy 2022, guys. Guys, this is a rebroadcast reaction where myself and Pineapples reacted to a video from April 14th, almost a year ago, guys, when some foolishness and let's just say F shit happened while I was trying to teach you all some basics about copyright strikes. There's always lots of questions and I was trying to do my duty out here explaining what a copyright strike was and how to fight one when all of a sudden some weirdo shit happened right in the middle of my live. So Pineapples and I took some time to go back. I'd never watched it again after I experienced it. Pineapple said she watched it a little bit, but we actually did a live reaction to it in October. So the first broadcast was April 14th when it happened live. I will have a link to the video down below. And the original um, reaction of myself and Pineapples will also be linked below during this broadcast like the first 24 hours um the original reaction of me and pineapples is still on members i will have that um not on members after tomorrow um so but both links will be available in the description box one might be on members but i'll release the member link to just a regular public or unlisted link um for you guys um by like let's just say wednesday a.m okay so if you want to watch the original reaction of me and pineapples you can see it uncut and just our raw reaction uh without myself and pineapples stopping and talking over um okay well talking over like this second you know so you you guys follow me anyway i hope that you're having a wonderful day thank you for coming through this is uh going to be a premiere so it's so much fun to see you guys live reaction anyway don't forget to thumbs up this live and i will see you in the next video by the way friend i respect you as a as a reactor by the way friend i respect you as a as a reactor, this is all about clout. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, how are you? We have a very special guest who is going to be joining us in just a moment. Um, so to that part, click on the link um, in Instagram. I put the link in Instagram. And uh, I sent you a DM with the link. Uh, you should be able to get to it from there. Let's see. Hopefully we are not having technical difficulties. We shall see. I hope everyone's doing great today. I think I saw a lot of you guys already this morning, but we are back. We're back. We're back. We're back by popular demand. Um, okay. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to any of you who are still in the morning time zone. If it's the evening, girl, we getting ready to cut up just a little something, 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 something uh something so uh guys give me a minute uh because i'm trying to get everything set up i'm waiting for my guests to come through so just give me a minute we're gonna i don't I'm, know if that's just his southern plate ooh, ooh. Jar. okay okay um uh, okay i see you can you just can you hit the hit the quan for me before i add you to this broadcast so I can make sure that um, that I've got 
that who needs to be here is here and there's no foolishness. Um, okay. Okie dokie. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Um... Okay, hey, how's it going? Hey, friend. How are you? Yeah. What's up? I'm doing good. How are you? Fine. Long time no see. We hadn't done this. Last time we'd done this, uh, <laughs> it was it was almost a whole shit show uh, happened. It was a shit. That was the beginning of the shit show series, I think. Yes, yes. That was, that was the, the beginning, beginning of, me. of a whole, what, six months worth of bullshit? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. yes. But that's okay. Um, that is that's okay. We uh it's um it seems like it was one of those we don't die, we multiply. So I don't know. It just it took on a life of itself. Guys, can you all say hello to pineapples in the chat, please? Can we get some pineapples, please? Can we get some pineapples in the chat, ma'am? What's you up, guys? chat? Uh, I can't see the chat at the moment, but I'm assuming that we are uh, that we are treating our guests, bougie gang gang up in this thing. Yes, we got the pineapples flying. Audrey Marcel, I see you, cutie squad. What's going on? D Harold, Sammy J, who was here first? Do you know who was here first? Uh, let's see. If I have it correct, maybe Lenise, Lenise TV, Love Noel, Latoy, uh, Dovely Creations. What's going on? Don't forget to subscribe to Real Talk Bougie Guys, uh, Hollywood Uncut, Anisha, Rose of Sharon, Nikki Caters, The Erics, Rose of Sharon, Danny Love, what's going on? All about Fifi, Jazzy. Yeah, Cece Monet, Cutie Squad, what's going on, my love? Uh, Everyday Life with Glamour Grannies, what's going on? Shay K. Uh, good morning, hon, or good afternoon. Excuse me. I'm still on that morning-ish. I'm sorry, guys. Um, Loretta Camp. My eyes are deceiving me. Um, am I missing anyone? Shay K. Maybe Shay Butta. I'm not sure if I saw her yet. Jay Day, what's going on? Uh, Mrs. Allen. Miss Brader's Life. What's going on? Nicole E. What's good? Um, Jude Carrera. Hello. Shay Butta. Um, Liz Jim. Hey Kiki, Crown of Curls, Dr. Amira, um, all that, all that, and 50 million bags of chips. Libra 1010, Thumbelina, KP, everybody, everybody, anybody, scream. Do you remember that? Do you remember those old chants they used to do? <laughs> Pineapples, am I losing you? Where are you, girl? No, you I'm still scream. here, friend. I'm here. The old chants from the club. I know what you're talking about, girl. Yes, absolutely. Okay, let's do this, guys, really, really quick. Um, guys, we I was I talked to Pineapples today, and I said, you know what? Um, with everything that's been going on, I feel like you and I, no matter how much we've, you know, kind of told our story in chats, told our stories here, there, and everywhere, people still don't really know like what is going on. And um, it's so funny that when I'm in the bushes sometimes and watching a chat, I hear people saying, pineapples, what happened? How did you get in? Like, what happened? And nobody really knows what happened. So I said, I said, hey, P, what if we, um, just react a little bit to like what happened and try to and just have a couple of laughs we're, we're not going to clear this up for some people we're probably going to confuse a few more i don't know it doesn't matter it's a it's a thursday afternoon um it's a good excuse to get together have some laughs um if you don't follow pineapples on instagram go ahead and do so um there is a treat that she posted um, there's someone out here on the YouTube streets who swore on a stack of Bibles for whatever that's worth that they've never cried on the YouTube streets. And once again, pineapples has provided the receipts that that's that, that it's a lie. The lie detector determined is a lie, right? Yes. It's definitely a lie as you will see on that treat. 
Yes. So it's, go it's, follow it's, my it's a trick or treat. Yes. It's absolutely a trick or treat and it's pretty it's pretty it's pretty tasty and I was happy to I was it just it kind of made my heart sing just a little bit. Um we're going to run this we're going to run this back with a little bit of the chat. Um you're going to see some you're going to see let me maybe I should take off the artwork so people can enjoy uh they can fully enjoy what's what's getting ready to go down here. Uh, we'll be talking over if you want to see this in is in its entirety um i'll have it linked in this video and it's in that playlist i keep telling y'all about there's um we just gonna talk about it okay um and you guys run your questions um through the chat uh we would love to answer any questions um i'm gonna drop the link in the discord if any uh, members would like to ask any questions, if you are a non-member, put your question down in the chat, okay? If you would like to um, come on the panel and you are uh, privy to the member postings, um, I'll, I may put the link there, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, we're going to get through a little bit of this before I even do any of that. So if you have a question, make sure you let me know so I can make sure to drop what you need uh, to be able to um, to be able to ask that question. But let, worst case scenario, just go ahead and um, and put it down in the chat and we will answer whatever questions we can. OK, um, so let's do it just like that. Any um, any anything you want to say right now? Um P. I don't know why we keep wanting to call you P, but I'm just like, girl, what you have any questions or any anything you'd like for the for our folks to know uh, well, about what, what, how you like felt that day? Well, yeah, what I felt that day was anger. Okay, um, somebody was lying on me, and they were a Karen, and they needed to get checked, and that's what happened. Mm. So let's go ahead and start it, and then we'll go ahead and um, get into some commentary, I guess. Okay, I'm going to start this. Guys, this day, this was... <laughs> I was actually giving... This is... Maybe this is um, ironic, possibly a little irony here. That I was actually in the middle of educating folk on how to respond to a uh, copyright notification. I was actually showing when I'd gotten copyright strike from Strong Mommy Chrissy... And um, this was like almost two years ago now. Um, and that was my only strike up until Crybaby Cheeseburger Puddle Puss Probation Puss um, did a copyright on me, which I used my my method and uh, my strike was taken away. Because I was walking everyone through my Strong Mommy Chrissy one. And um, lo and behold, this, this happened. This is... Um a template use this video as okay this is what i need to do and this is how you're gonna fight it okay fill out the dispute form if you want to get a lawyer you go right on ahead um at the end of the day our legal system is designed for us to be able to use with or without attorneys now if you are on fighting a death row case well don't take that advice from me because, yeah, <laughs> you don't need a lawyer okay pineapples um, if you're on death row you last person you need to consult with is, is someone who you know is not, not smarter than you i don't you. have a i don't who have you a know license. that you know what you know mm -hmm. you need to make sure that you uh do your due diligence okay um we have a guest uh-oh who's the guest who's hey, uh, <laughs> can you hear me can you hear me yes i can hear you hey hey girl hey Hey, how are you? I'm doing good. It's how pineapples. Okay. Yes. And yes. I have a motherfucking uh -oh. announcement. Well, oh, you can't make the okay. bushes. Oh, okay. Hold on wait. a second. Wait. Oh, okay. Wait. Let me take. Let me. Let me uh, take this business down um, with some uh, maybe messy pleasure. I don't know. Hold on. Let me. Let me just take this business off the screen. Okay. Um, because... I was handling business, guys. Oh, wait, did I do that? Hold on. Let's do this. Okay, that's better. Let's. I got a. I got a nice messy screen up. Um. So you said you have an announcement. Yes, friend. I have an What's announcement. What's going on? That, you know, you were talking about how messy these YouTube streets can get and all the fuckery. 
that goes on out here, right? Did I say something about that? Yeah, you said you mentioned some fuckery. Early, okay. Early. Well, I I do I do talk about that sometimes. Yes. Okay. okay. Yeah. Well, I like talking about fuckery. Okay. Thank you. Yes. That was cute. Yes. So, Thank you, baby. Last night there was some fuckery going on. Okay. Really? Notice was this was on? April fourteenth. Fuckery. You know we go to bed early over here because I got a nine year old. <laughs> what what was going on? What was going on is some bitches were talking shit. Are you about kidding? me and their motherfucking? Did I hiccup? <laughs> pineapples? Did you hear that? I was like, "What?" And I hiccup. Pineapples? Where are you? Fran? Yeah. Okay. I I can't tell if it's that. It's like echoing over top. So I'm okay, trying to so make you sure need I'm to you live and stuff. <laughs> and okay, I can't so... tell the difference when you're talking. That's all. Oh, okay. What? Okay. So I was about to say, "What about now?" Duh. Um, okay. Let me so I'm gonna mute my mic a little bit. I'm not sure what's happening. Are you listening to YouTube through? No. Are you listening? Oh, you're only you listening through StreamYard, right? Correct. Okay. All right, here we go. Okay. Can you anyone tell me in the chat if they hear echo, please? Live. Okay, and I'm going to address that shit. Now I'm not gonna address it on here with you. But since everybody's in the motherfucking room, I'm letting everybody know. Be ready, bitch. I'm dropping a motherfucking video tonight addressing the fuckery mm. that's going on in these motherfucking YouTube streets. Because no bitch out here is ever going to play me. Mm. Don't you ever lie on me and say you fucking approach me. I will slaughter a bitch. Everybody know I murder bitches on fucking YouTube all the time. Okay. That's Can we just know. notice who was here then and who's here now? Mm. Like people who were here, like all the riders, all the yes. riders, all the all the dyers. Okay. <laughs> all the fakers. all the. Yes, all the, the all the name. Can we notice all the name the changes? Can we notice the cast of characters? Very interesting, mm -hmm. guys. You see this. Yes. Um, welcome, welcome, welcome. This is not your imagination. Pineapples and I are here to relive the day, April 14th, when all hell broke loose. Who were the people? You said there were some bitches the night before who were talking about you. What happened? So the bitch specifically was Cheeseburger. Mm, okay. cry AKA baby. fat ass aka disgusting ass aka lying ass aka Karen ass cry baby, baby. bunk bed oh, yes cry baby cry let's baby. call her bunk bed too because i like that Ooh, i like that bunk bed bunk bed okay <laughs> yes <laughs> <laughs> so she was talking about you okay and um, you didn't, that was, that well, wasn't she cool. was crying about me. Let's, let's, oh, let's get real specific. She okay. was crying. She, she was, is that the shed a tear moment that's on your Instagram today? Oh yeah, because I was her mom. I was her oh. mom. Oh, no. Um, okay. But you were never her mod. Oh, girl, bye. Girl, bye. Yeah, no. Girl, you were too bye. busy modding for, um, OGs. Oh. Thank you, friend. I know, I know, but she doesn't know. You were you were busy modding for people who had like real reaction channels. Okay, thank you. Yes, okay. real reactors. Thank real you. Reactors. Okay, let's let's keep going because you see, I was about an hour and twenty. I was getting ready to get offline, guys. You guys know I <laughs> I try to get off, you know, at a certain time, and pineapples came through and just went bloop. Okay, that's what I do. I fucking. She said that's what I do. Asses. So tonight I'm gonna get in a bitch ass, <laughs> like I did. And if a motherfucker got a problem with it, then they just won't have a motherfucking problem. Well, you know, the one thing about YouTube to me is that, um, look, it's, it's like Main Street, right? It's Main Street. And sometimes you got to, I mean, you guys know me. I get on here every, you know, I don't want to say every day, but I get on here at least once a week. I gotta, I gotta set somebody straight. So I... <laughs> I, you know, I'm the type of person that if something is wrong, I got to talk about it. So I don't uh, blame you. So you're saying someone was telling some stories about you? Yeah, I'm saying that Storm, Storm was talking shit about me and I could give two fucks, two fucks what's going on with her. I don't care about that shit. What happened? So, well, 
you said you, nothing happened. You said you dropped that's the video. Like, you dropped the video. The problem is nothing happened. That's the fucking problem. Nothing happened. But when I drop this video, I'm gonna lay all that shit out. And then everybody can tell me what the hell this delusional motherfucker is talking about. And that's how that's gonna go. Because I don't get into beef. Pineapples, I think I was scared to ask you a question because I was like, what in the whole fuck is going on? <laughs> because this was out of the, this was straight out of nowhere, okay? She was on that crying straight out her of nowhere. Ass off, okay? <laughs> she was on that crying her brains out because her fake mod had talked shit about her on the Keisha Payne video, which I didn't talk shit. I said, love you, Keisha. And then some bitch from her chat came over to proceed to roast me and roast and toast me in the comments and say you were her mud no the fuck i was not okay. and so what if you were though like is that supposed to be a blood it, oath are you like it, part of are you like clicked up for life when you're exactly. a mod over there is that is that how it works because i don't know over in that camp they're weird i don't like weird shit. is that it like is. a blood oath kind of thing if you mod over there I wasn't aware of that. His sister chain like, and like, gang. Exactly. <laughs> a gang that steals from the people and then rolls their ass afterwards. Oh, That's okay. What kind of okay. That seems like to me. Ah, uh, okay, okay, okay. Yes. <laughs> okay, that makes sense. Okay, let's keep it going. Okay, with people. I just come out here, I do my shit, I drop my videos, but I got something to say. And so, be since careful. I don't have and all that shit. Pardon, I, I'm sorry. I think everybody knows that I don't give a fuck. Okay, we know mm. that already. Okay, we are. That's out there. So I gotta do what I gotta do. You did what you did, and then you deleted your shit, and now you gotta suffer the consequences. Um. <laughs> so uh, uh, it's it's no bullshit. It's no. It's I'm not dropping no lies. Yeah. Well, you don't. You don't normally. I mean, everyone's got their thing on here. Live may not. Is that? If that's. If you don't. You don't do live, right? I'm, so. I'm, I'm talking about um, lies. I don't do lies. Oh, no, lies. Yes. So, what? That's, um. I don't come in there with no bullshit. Everything on my shit is receipts. I'm all about receipts. So. Receipts, so what happened? Uh, because. That, okay. So. He I'm seeing. I'm about to get her, and I don't like her. Girl, I don't even fucking give a shit about you. So I don't care to like you or just why would you be out to get her that doesn't even make oh, yeah, uh, so i don't like her and all this stuff i'm gonna break it down on the video yeah please tune in and i just wanted to let you know that Brian. so i will be dropping on the video soon. girl you've let me know you've Thank let you. 252 people know <laughs> so i guess 250 257 um and strong, yes and I'm sure that's been multiplied by now because we've got let's let's factor. You know I love a good math problem. Um, let's factor in the bone collectors. So right, right. The, the bone collectors. We're trying to do some multiplication on, here. Carry it on. Yeah, <laughs> so right, right the they told in. two friends, and those two friends <laughs> told two friends, and so on and so on. So yeah, I'm sure yeah. I'm sure word is getting around. Now, friend, um, what time, time is this video dropping? I don't know what time, but it's going to drop okay. in a few minutes. I got to dip out now. But I just wanted to drop you. Him. You came and dropped if this were, and but, dipped on me, girl. Girl, thank you for thank you for letting us know. If you are out here and you are not subscribed to Pineapples, um, newbie and Empress, I think I'm getting ready to answer your question right ahead, now. Go um, ahead, subscribe, hit your uh, notifications. Can uh, someone drop Pineapples uh, channel, please? Video. Pineapples, are you are you good? You got what you had needed to get out. That's it. I'm done. Okay, that's it, and that's all. Okay. All right, uh, pineapples. Is this going to be in a premiere? Is there going to be a chat room going on, or are you just going to um, drop it like it's hot? I, I, I might just drop it like it's hot, but I might do a premiere. I don't know. It depends on how I feel in a couple hours. How I feel like doing it. Mm. Okay. Don't well, worry. I appreciate you um, getting the word out. We will be there, um, and um, I'm going to just say this to okay, everyone: be there. Right. Oh, yes, ma'am. I just want to ask you a question. Yes, ma'am. You you don't have no type of feelings about me as being your mod. Okay, you know I'm mod for. I'm looking like girl. Mod. What? Okay. Uh -huh. So if somebody got a fake mod issue, fake mod issues mm -hmm. and fuckery, I don't got time for. 
So stay tuned for fake mod. So fake mod? What does that mean? Mod. That means what does that, that mean? That I was their mod and I don't know a goddamn thing about. That's what the fuck it means. <laughs> That's I don't weird. know what the hell you talking about. I wasn't your mod. I don't even fuck with your ass like that to be Ooh, your mod. Okay. Okay, earn it, boo. All right, so I'm about to get ready to go. And plan. look at my face. Do you see the faces I'm making? <laughs> I'm like, what right. in the whole entire fuck is going on, guys? Okay, pineapples. I think we need to break for a second and tell yes. people what's going on. Yes. So, let just stop me. So this is so basically, pineapples kind of entered into a chat where some people were talking shit about her because of a message, a comment she had left under KP's channel when Pineapples, when, uh, excuse me, Damn Cheeseburger, AKA Crybaby, was mad because not only was KP killing it on some um, parodies, she was mad just the fact that people that she thought ride with her ride with other people. I think she thinks that people would just log into YouTube to just watch her like she was like the Cosby show or something and they didn't watch anything else. All they watched was her. And if you commented under other stuff, it was a problem. And she was actually mad. She wasn't mad at pineapples in my opinion. I think she was mad because I think that she was mad because KP really kind of, I think roasted her. And I think her feelings were hurt about that. That was the first that she had confront, been confronted about her looks, or, you know, period. I'm not going to expand on that. You guys figure that one out. And just the fact that there are people better doing what she was trying to do. And she felt like she things were out of control. She was realizing that this little cluster that she created was not any longer in her control and she went all crazy lady on everybody does that sound a little bit like from the outside looking in that's what i that was my look at my face that's what i was thinking that is it but the thing is she just went into like a deep hole of bullshit so basically she went crazy on me she cried because i wasn't her mod that's the key word cried because i wasn't her mod I mean, I was no longer fucking with her ass. Then she proceeded to come out with a response video with fake ass motherfucking receipts. She came with like a, like, you know how your grandmother's got like, not your grandmother. <laughs> um, like, you know how back in the day, let's say your great, great grandmother or your mom's grandmother used to have like a knitting bag with like a whole bunch of stuff in it, some needles and yarn and receipts from Walmart and stuff. She came out with a bunch of receipts talking about she had been to the post office mailing off a whole bunch of stuff. And it was like, girl, if you don't sit your old unorganized, nasty self down talking about I got all these receipts that I sent a gift card to every mod. And I was like, but what does that have to do with what you were sitting there mad about? Hey, Which at the yeah. end of the day, you were mad because kp posted a video roasting your ass and pineapples commented under it at the end of the day you weren't mad you were mad because of that video and you were mad that someone that you thought was coming to give you some shine was over there shining on someone else and it made you mad that's that's you were jealous okay jelly you were like you were jealous bitch shit that's exactly it, Fran. And also, yeah. a lot of people were so mad. Huh? A lot of people were so mad at me. Oh, my God. Look at the you people in this chat. Half the her. people don't even come over here anymore. If you they do, they're in the bushes. Look, this is the welcome back to the Love, Lies, and Lace Fronts chat where we don't lie, we don't cheat, we don't steal. We separate the real from the fake since day one. Mm -hmm. um, established in what? Was it 2020? I started this chat. 20. 2019 end of 2019 so established in 2019 we've been separating the real from the fake and uh and that's it okay and if you want to uh come back to the chat the doors of the chat is open and if you feel like you have um you've shown your ass um dollar sign bougie gang a a everything can be helped with a with a with a girl 
it's okay we don't hold grudges over here okay uh come through correct and uh join back the chat we don't care we know you don't have any place to chat right now it's getting lonely out there and you know that you aligned yourself with a bozo okay um let's keep listening because this gets better guys did you know storms in here no not in the chat right now maybe she is i don't know um she better not show up but um yes she'll be in this she's coming along in just a second guys storm calls in stay tuned for storm calling in go ahead get your emails out send out your instagram posts notify bone collectors hurry up okay let's finish this segment with pineapples and guess who's calling in in just a minute okay stay tuned I'm here now Shit, you're a mod in my chat i'm about to drop you from here okay and so everybody be be there be there Okay. Um, be there or be square, right? <laughs> be square. And and you don't want to be square out on these streets. No, no, you don't. You don't. But there's no squares in here because this is bougie gang gang. Squares, gang, gang, gang. Though, that's fucking hmm? people that's not squares. That's the problem. That's that's what's Girl, going on. can we get some manicure emojis in the out. chat? Please? They are putting flames. You know, look, at the end of the day, people love a good little uh a little a good little argument, a little beef, a little beef session, yes. okay. Um, at the end of the day, look, it sounds like there is a discrepancy in terms of the truth. Okay. Someone's telling yeah. it and someone's uh, creating it. That's the one thing about me. I don't drop nothing mm -hmm. that's not verified. Nothing that's not verified. Okay, exactly. all of my shit is shit that you've seen with your own eyes. So I'm not in here. Let me tell you, because last night, I'm going I'm to mm -hmm. be honest. I, uh, I was watching uh, Toya. Toya was dropping her tea because old Jeremy came grimy into her in inbox when she was trying to, as a mother and as a reactor, drop him some information about one of his daughters. And he and Keisha got on their letter writing ca campaigns. They were sitting at the at the um, at the kitchen counter, typing typing out uh, notes to Toya and uh, trying to fill out privacy complaints and on their bitch assnessness. And uh, that's what I was paying most attention to. And then Paris went live, um, further um, amplifying what we already knew. Well, the thing, yeah. you know what the good thing is, friend? I'm glad you kept me on here because mm -hmm. I didn't put this in my video because I already did mm -hmm. my shit and I'm not reacting to you. I didn't get, you I didn't, I'm, not, I'm not on notification gang gang, okay? I ain't on notification mm -hmm. gang gang for her. But guess what? Somebody dropped it in my comments. Okay. Oh, yeah, she's on there talking about you. Oh, oh, a bitch on there talking about me? Was it anyone time. that you, was That's it like a deal. subscriber? Was I it a viewer? Time. Was it I a viewer from the bushes? Okay. Was it someone from the bushes? Is it a no, subscriber? No, 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 no. Is it a mod? No, girl, it was some lady that was talking about was crazy. The lady they classified as crazy, but she was crazy that motherfucking time. Because I seen the goddamn comment now who is that that they're are you still okay. talking about storm the lady they classified as crazy who are you talking about pineapples so yeah i'm gonna tell you who it was, it was cassandra you know cassandra oh but you know okay so cassandra green she is who she was back then but right so they tried to say okay guys i'm gonna slow this for a second um cassandra green is a member here she's bougie gang gang she comes to the chat um cassandra green is a lady who um sought out sister chain for some help not according to cassandra not for monetary but i guess for just some kind of support in terms of i guess she didn't know what to do she was searching for a car look there's two or three different versions to the story and since we know one or one of the people specifically is a known liar i can't agree with her see hey cassandra see cassandra's right correct cassandra's like okay i'm here so cassandra they were trying to classify you as crazy. And we know this. Cassandra had reached out to me in my comments. And I think that's what also got Storm pissed off at me. Because Cassandra was like, look, I never did anything. I never asked her for anything. I was asking for some help. I was asking for someone to kind of help me in a car buying process. Some, that's what Cassandra told me. I never could talk to storm about it because when storm finally called in on this day storm was just yelling at me she wouldn't let me ask her a question she just kind of dumped on me and i think ricky i don't know if this is around the time that ricky beat her ass 
Okay, and I'm I'm sorry for anyone who has suffered from domestic violence, but this was some weird shit that was happening. And literally, it just kind of all happened as I was getting ready to close this live. So I was still kind of like, what's going on? Because guys, if you don't know it, for as much as I do watch tea and stuff, it it at this point, a lot of it had been specific to the three moms. I wasn't really paying attention to what was going on, like all the bickering and all that shit on the YouTube. I mean, it just wasn't interesting to me. Um, so yeah, this was a whole this this seems like years ago, but it was only six months ago. Um, let's let's keep playing because you're getting ready to hang up. But yeah, Cassandra, we know you weren't crazy, but uh you're that lady who you went to for help. Um, with your car buying process, that lady had everyone convinced that something was wrong with you and that you, just like they did to Lolly Aperpico, um, just like they've done to every person who's gone to help, asked for help, um, she would say, Sister Chain gave $100, Sister Chain gave $10. Or There's always some kind of discrepancy which what was said was done and what the person said was done. Um, is that... Is that does that coincide so, with what, yeah, yeah, I just want to say that I was minding my black ass business, right? Okay, me too. And somebody hit me in my Cassandra hit me in my comments and she said she's over there right now and she's talking about you and she's talking about me. So I took my black ass right on over there and I screen recorded her ass and mm. then I that's how I dropped that video on her. Mm. So yeah, I was definitely not notification. Oh, game. and that's when she we we uh you busted storm crying boo that, exactly. that thing was funny okay and she deleted that, that shit already but it was too yeah lovely. but it still mm. exists yeah so it's dropping be ready and be there that's what the hell i got to say okay, okay. well maybe this can clear look this is this is um it's not clear enough, because there wasn't ever nothing to I, I was trying to be optimistic there was nothing ever time okay, on. it wasn't nothing to <laughs> on. you are a delusional when you're somebody's delusional in their mind it's nothing you can do about it. So there's, so you're saying that this person is creating a narrative that there's a beef between you two, but you're getting ready. To, okay. You're getting ready to clear it up tonight. You're going to clear it up tonight and you're going to squash it because there is no beef. This is some sort of tall tale. Is that what you're saying? Okay. Delusional fuckery. Um, AKA, like, so not even real. You're trying to loop me up into some BS. Yes. Okay. Um, so Gwen, no beef. Let's not use the word beef. Pineapple saying it's no beef. I'm not, she's saying she's not involved in anything. She's saying it's no beef. It's baloney. Okay, guys, let's skip ahead a little bit. Pineapples, you're still in here for a minute. Um, I wish we could listen to this whole thing, but I know you're going to, you know. All right. So here, here's, let's see the end of pineapples, but guys, this is posted and you guys can watch this whole thing. It starts at about an hour and 30 minutes. Um, let's see. Pineapples is getting ready to hang up and let's see what's going on. We'll check in, but I'm not going to be in the chat like about that. At all. Okay. That's um, fine. cause I don't, you gotta do you know This is saying? your channel. I'm not, I'm going to nobody's channel and try to take it over. Go ahead and do what you yeah, guys no, wait, no. look at look at in the in the chat, guys. That's Toya, Toya, shouts out to Toya if you're back there while in you know taking care of the new baby. <laughs> Toya said, "Isn't Storm the one who dropped the freight Chris audio?" Look, Storm has been out here doing foolishness and fake stuff for a long time, guys. Period. Long time. Period. Right. <laughs> Period. <laughs> Talk her face live, and I'll be back. And then we can, and we will, we will close the loop on this whole thing. Okay. All I, right. I closed, um, wait a minute. You open it, and I'm going motherfucking close it. That's girl. how that's going to fucking go. Okay. Don't open. Gogeta, this door. you just need to come it's back at the beginning, baby, and start low. from the beginning. It's fine. How about that? Right it now, like it's open. It's open. It's like Slide the bar yeah. back, yeah. or just okay. you understand from the beginning. You came in here late, Hello, everybody's. Hello, everyone's. Nisi, if you are here, girl, come out these bushes. Don't, okay. Uh, Nisi. No, she's, she's not here yet. I am. I'm oh, letting. Look at um. Look at KP. KP's in here. Um, this is back in April, guys look on the other screen on my on the screen not not your chat but the the chat that's in this video it says after i did a couple of videos on storm 
and pineapples made a comment the chaser started up with pineapples i cannot wait see what they do is a sneak attack if they want you they're going to come around the side of the house and they're going to start trying to bust your windows or mess with your neighbors and then they try to create a commotion and then they're going to come for you in a sneak attack and you're like we knew some mischief was going on but we didn't know this was going on um look at nicole e back in the in the background talking about fran please don't get in this i i wasn't trying to i wasn't trying to this shit just came and just it just it came and it, there was nothing i could do um okay so let's keep going guys um so pineapples i think you're getting ready to hang up in a second let's go okay you don't bought you first of all i you just not in my league you gotta be in the league first bitch that's the first motherfucking thing that you gotta do you you even on my worst day you can never so i'm just go ahead and let her get in friend okay and you do what you have to do and i'll i'll see all y'all later in the okay. premiere hopefully anyway yeah, in the premiere. I hope to drop a premiere. If I don't, I'll drop a fucking video. I don't know. But I'll see y'all later. Okay. All right, Frank. All right, I'll see you. Okay. Um, oh, jeez. Hold on a second. Okay. I was like, oh, my God. Okay. Um, <laughs> hold on one second, guys. This is the deal. Rose of Sharon, Um, what's going on? There's lots of there's lots of messages being deleted. I don't know what's being deleted. I need for y'all to, um, you know, unless someone is being super duper, absolutely, um, everyone be nice, say what you mean. Don't say it mean. <sighs> okay. I'm um, trying to give a warning. <laughs> you don't have to act like you just checked into church i mean you can express yourself how you want to um where is the call in it's right there hun hold on reese reese let me see if i can pin it this what's up reese? Going so fast nobody 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 type anything for a second what was i trying to do pineapples what reese, was there... going on is those bitches were going crazy okay let me type it one okay more time. they were mad yeah, there was. I think there was a little bit of. Um, they were mad because I think we had some some L to the S to the A in the house, which okay, that's that's normal. It's okay. you know, Anna, you can slow the chat down. I can slow the chat down. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, Thank the you chat was going Anna. really crazy. We were okay. like, wait a second. Okay. Let me. Um, and I think I just had gotten my I hair know. freshly braided. I'm just gonna say that. <laughs> oh, my braids were paused? looking fresh. Am I paused, guys? Do you know that dress over my shoulder, pineapples? I still have not worn it yet. It looks, oh, I tried Frank, it on the other on day. Now. I was going to wear it to that wedding this past Saturday, but it was so cold. I didn't wear it. Oh, God. Um, I bought that during Rona and we never went anywhere. Um, but maybe I can wear there. it for Christmas. Verena, thank Verena, you. Verena, can you hear me? Hold on. Someone's saying, oh, advice with Mel, who can. <sighs> Friend, behave now. Okay. <laughs> bye bye. Yeah, I'm seeing a cast of characters here of people who I hope to yeah, never see. Yeah, people who okay. are so mad about. I see it going. Men. Yeah, I feel like I'm frozen. Am I frozen over there on you guys' side? Yeah, I. Everything uh, is fine on your end. Okay. My. This chick was getting ready to come through and mess up my okay. my internet because she's so such a weirdo. S Wiseman, what's good, uh, lady? Cassandra. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, take a deep breath. Take Stormy, this is when, me? This is when she got mad at yes, me. Yes, I can. Take a deep breath. I'm no, ahead. I'm go. not gonna take a deep breath. I don't. I'm not. Let me tell you Storm, something. Can you hear me? Yes, can you hear me? Take a deep breath. Mm -hmm. I don't okay. care about that. Let me tell you something. So wait, can I just say something too, really quick? Oh, I fucked it up. Look, this door. This, this is a door. You probably do you know? Do you see how the misunderstanding with she and I occurred? She had feedback. Do you hear that? I see it. She had feedback. Okay. So I said initially, take a deep breath. She said, I'm not going to take a deep breath. But because she was listening probably on a TV and in StreamYard, uh -huh. she heard it twice. So she thought I said it to her again. Do you hear that? Let's but watch it one more time. But she came in flustered as fuck. She was already flustered, but Look she thought I had told her. her. 
it. You could see my lips were not moving and you could hear it was the feedback. You could hear it loud and clear on her end. And she got mad. Like she was already ready. Like, I'm not going to say she was already ready to argue with me. But when I said, hey, take a deep breath. And I was just saying, I know that like everybody this is a little tense situation i was ready look at my i was like girl let's go like let's talk about it i wasn't i pfft. okay whatever anywho let's go so i'm no ho i'm oh, no bitch you allowed her like i'm girl this is ridiculous okay let's i you guys and i'm gonna tell you pineapples have you seen this since this happened I have watched it, but it was months ago when, you know, after we filmed the video and then I went back and took a look at it. I'm going to be honest with you. I have not. I walked into the kitchen. This I'm was playing. Mess. Okay. And I see it I was going, like, oh, I my God. Like I knew Storm I had been on here, on here on side? but I everything is fine. I have not okay. watched this in my... its entirety since, okay. since I lived it. I never watched this in its entirety. And when I saw it playing the other day, I said to myself, okay, take a deep breath. Okay. Watch take, this storm. You can hear me. Yes, I can take a deep breath. I'm, no, I'm not going to take a deep breath. breath. I don't, I'm not. Let me tell you storm, something. Can you hear me? Yes. Can you hear me? Take a deep breath. Mm -hmm. I don't care about that. Let me tell you something, <laughs> friend. Let me just say this. This is a one-sided battle. You're going to stand up for her. She's your mind. Go right ahead. I'm not going to get on here and curse. And my thing is, how are you calling me a bitch? How are you calling me a hoe? How are you calling me anything? Well, you personally don't know me. I hold a license that I have to protect. Do you think I'm going to get on here? Oh, God. And she argue lied. and yell and be I know. She was lying. No. Just like she said I could reach out to her, she could have reached out to me. Not once did I. Me, can you tell me what's going on, though? I I was not in your chat last night. I was over Only watching. Only thing is, if Paris. anybody really truly watched my chat, I was crying because I I felt betrayed. Oh, okay. So she admitted to crying. Mm. And if you were there, you see it. I don't get on here, and I'm not going to sit on here and call nobody no bitch or no hoe. I've been with the same man that's right motherfucking here that a lot of people can't show. So I'm no hoe. I'm no bitch. You allowed her to get on here and totally cuss, disrespect look, me. I, as look, as we're, as look pain, so I'm, no, I'm not going to argue with you, as but far we're as as pain, I care nothing. They can drop it. I have nothing to hide. If they continue to go by Cassandra Glenn's word, yes, she is being who under is a police Cassandra Glenn? A who lady who was Glenn? mad that Sister Chain would not buy her a car. I have the original copies. I have the police report. So if they come on here with emails, they'll now be in into a uh, police investigation because you cannot. But she called me a Sandra snitch. Or this bitch loves the police. Would like to make her a channel and come out and speak. I'm plaintiff. She's defended. She can do that. I don't care. And as far as Keisha Payne, I don't care. You can make a video. You can make a gap. I show my face. I show my home, I show my child, my dog, my life. Pineapples does not. So, of course, if I can see her face, I can sit here and do the same thing and talk about her. But I'm not that kind of woman. And she's mm. not that kind of woman, obviously, because she hides behind the camera. She can drop the video. <laughs> I'm going to laugh at it. I'm going to continue to be on my channel. I'm going to continue to be Sister Chain. My storm chases are going to continue to be there. You guys... I so, love all my storm chasers, but I'm not going to be attacked. You allow her to. Oh, my bad, guys. I was trying to refresh the screen. Ooh, ooh. That was my bad. So pineapples really quick while this is refreshing. Okay. She felt that I allowed you. So yeah, like I'm, I'm, I guess I'm your mother. Right. And I allowed you to say certain things. Um, we're adults. And you know, we use the cursey words here over at Bougie Gang because we're grown. 
And if that's what you need to use to express yourself, I don't have a problem with that. If someone doesn't want to be called a bitch, I would say probably don't be one, don't act like one, and don't demonstrate that you're big and bad like you you're, are not one. I forgot what I so oh, why don't fam answered a question. I don't know why she would have a problem with that because that lady uses that language all the time. Exactly. So I don't know why this would be a problem for her when she is um this is her this is how she operates the so the problem is she why wasn't would you ready. care she wasn't ready that was the problem she was pretending to be a nurse she was in the process of getting her amazon nursing degree and so she was pretending that she was an upstanding citizen when the truth has already come out so that we know right. that was total bullshit she used a she used a certain profile type to gain people's trust to make it seem like she is a pro she used a professional title basically guys she told you guys she's a there's people out here still who's like storm's not a nurse look at the end of the day who cares what anybody does you could be a grave digger out here you could be a grocery store uh sacker you can be on the receiving line at amazon you can be a doctor a lawyer a butcher a baker a candlestick maker i don't care okay I personally do not care. I don't care what you do for a living. At the end of the day, this is a woman who wants to be in with the in crowd. So she decided that she was going to be a nurse. She is barely a home health aide. This is a woman who has a criminal background who she has admitted. I'm not exposing anything. She's admitted to this. This is a woman who has a background that does not permit her to any longer work in people's homes at this moment i don't care if she can petition i don't care if she can write a letter to santa claus at this moment at that moment at these moments when she is using a position of care and compassion and medicine to gain favor with people and status okay to run an organization called sister chain like i'm helping people she used all of this as a cover for people to trust her and she was anything but trustworthy what do you say to that pineapples okay this is what i say to that if you have more than five chins don't come for me okay girl <laughs> okay if you drive a car and you honk in the horn with your stomach ah! don't come for me <laughs> okay if you a fucking somebody with a reconstructed team don't come for me my god if you are over 600 pounds mm, and i'm collective in that bed business don't come for me that's all i'm asking you if you are you. testing the limits of a king size <laughs> can you say can we all say don't come for me <laughs> if you have a headrest with jerry curl juice all over that motherfucker, don't, don't come, come for me, me. if Very you good. have an amazon nursing degree don't come for me. If you have elephant ankles, don't come for me. If you have more than two fupas, don't come for me. That's, if that's you all get I'm tired walking to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, friend. I was minding my business. You came for me, sis. If you burned 300 calories going to the toilet. <laughs> Wait a minute, you came from me, bra. That's what I mean. I'm sorry, not sick. Wait, if you, you don't wear me, a bra. Oh my, if you come on the screen with dirty ass bonnets. I mean, if your feet are dirty. Days, <laughs> if we could go on for days, literally. Are your feet black <laughs> from dirt? Right, like if you went a door to explore back at, to the police station, don't come for me. If your cigarettes are six inches long. If you're smoking Newport 1000s, don't come for me, okay? Wait, if you got busted in the last 30 minutes of a lie, <laughs> I mean 30 days, Ooh. I mean 30 weeks, I mean what, 30 in your seconds. life. 30 seconds, right? <laughs> so basically, Storm... Everybody gonna keep their foot on all your necks, all five of your yes, necks. Yes, that energy. Because you Wait, are getting you put someone nerves. in critical condition who is Why? sitting over to their mama's house Sis. talking and smoking Newport 1000s right there with you. <laughs> if you found 
your uh your twinsy in cigarette land yeah don't come for me with them newport 1000s right. don't if you have a couch back oh if don't you look like your me. breath stank right <laughs> like i mean girl we can go on for days like you're so roastable yet you insist on roasting everybody out girl i'm not understanding it girl I'm my black ass business and here she come with this fuck shit I, so girl, I was teaching me. a lesson on how to fight a strike. <laughs> he was minding okay. a black ass business. I was just trying to be, guys, um, next week, YouTube coaching class, collective class. I'm looking for 25 students, okay? I'm looking for 25. Dig deep in those pockets. I will put a community post and um, there will be a link in my link tree. Let's get signed up, guys. We are doing some group coaching on Zoom. Um, yes, we're not doing this on YouTube streets anymore. Um, we're gonna do it in Zoom, like we've like dignified uh, professionals of YouTube that we are. But yeah, I was trying to do one of my classes if you watch the beginning of the video and this happened, but that's okay. Um, Cause this is YouTube and this kind of stuff happens. But let's, let's finish watching Storm. Um, I wanted to reset so you guys could see the chat. So my bad on that, but it gave us a chance to kind of talk a little bit. Um, I'm not going to take a deep breath. I don't, I'm not, let me tell you something. Can you hear me? Yes. Can you hear me? Girl, look how, look how mm -hmm. grimy she got I don't care about that. that. Let me tell you something, friend. Let me just say this. This is a one-sided battle. You're going to stand up for her. She's your mod. Go right ahead. I'm not going to get on here and curse and... My thing is, how are you calling me a bitch? How are you calling me a hoe? How are you calling me anything when well, you personally don't know me? Mm. I hold a license that I have to protect. That's a lie. You think I'm going to get on here and argue and yell and be unwomanly? No. Just like she said I could reach out to unwomanly. her, she could have reached out to me. Not once did I me, Can you tell me what's going on, though? I I was not in your chat last night. I was over only watching. Thing is, and if Tara. anybody really truly watched my chat, I was crying because oh. I I felt betrayed. You were crying. You said you've never Amaz cried on your second time, though. And time, if you were there, you see second time I don't crying. Get really on here, okay. and I'm not going to sit on here and call nobody no bitch or no hoe. I've been with the same man. That's right, motherfucking here. Oh, was that Ricky? That a lot of people can't Ricky, show. Ricky, 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 Ricky. So I'm no hoe. <laughs> I'm no bitch. You allowed her to get on here and totally What's upon a time not long ago? Look, I, look, we're, Keisha look, Payne, so I'm, no, I'm not going to argue with you, as but we're adults. Payne, I care nothing. They can drop it. I have nothing to hide. If they continue to go by Cassandra Glenn's word, Yes, she is being who under is a Cassandra Glenn. Oh, a lady Cassandra Glenn, Glenn is bougie gang in this would thing. Would not buy her a car. Cassandra Glenn knows copy. real I ones. The police report. Right. So if they come on here with emails, they'll now be in into a uh, in police investigation because mm, you cannot police investigation. Use it. Now Sandra Glenn or whoever she is would like to make her a channel and come out and speak. I'm plaintiff. She's defended. She can do that. I don't care. And as far as Keisha Payne, I don't care. You can make a video. You can make a gap. I show my face. I show my home. I show my child, my dog, my life. Pineapples does not. So, of course, if I wait, you're just face, once you're just talking about Keisha the same thing and talk about her. Wait, pineapples, but I'm not you that kind of woman. And she, so she was talking so about Keisha. So she was talking about though. Keisha. And then she goes right into you like. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Like yeah. she was mad. She was really mad because I think she wanted some. I don't know what the attention she wanted from you, but she was mad at Keisha's video. But she got mad at Keisha Payne. She was mad at KP because KP put on that motherfucking funeral hat. That thing and was roasted so funny. that bitch down to the ground. Oh my god, okay? it was hilarious. And I was up under that chat. That's what the fuck the problem was. Oh my god. Okay, that's what the real problem was. I think, guys, I've got a news flash. I think Storm uh, unsubscribed officially from uh, like three of her ghost channels of me because my my uh, my sub count went down by three. Ooh. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Oh my god, but it's the watch time that pays so storm. It doesn't matter unsubscribe if you want to keep watching boo-boo because we know your ego won't let you not 
Right. She's not that kind of woman, obviously, because she mm. hides behind the camera. Mm. She can drop the video. Mm. I'm going to laugh Back at it. One. I'm going to continue to be on my channel. I'm going to continue to be Sister Chain. My storm chasers are going to continue to be there. You guys, so, I love all my storm chasers, but I'm not going to be attacked. You allow her to come on here, call me bitches. Now it's my hoes, fault. Fat, ugly, storm. Cut for Look. 20,000 minutes. You so are bipartial. One, those are all facts. You are bipartial. So That's your mod, and you know her. It's a one sided fight. Uh, how do I know storm? How do I know pineapples? I know you pineapples from my you cat. Just said that you were Look, that I'm bipartial. Uh, storm, That's my storm, mod. I gave you an opportunity to come on here. I don't care, and I'm saying what I have to say. Okay. You can cut me off. See you, storm chasers. Love you. Hi, my lovely people. Do you see that? See, right, the funny guys. thing is, let Storm. me let me just stop right there. I never, if you want to see the whole thing in its entirety, react to it. I don't care. Be my guest. Um, run it all around this internet if you want to. I do not care. You are welcome. You have my permission. Okay? Anyone out there who wants to react, you're welcome uh, to do so. If you would like to react to the statements and the assertions made by, uh, by Crybaby Cheeseburger. Um... I was cool as a cucumber. I did. Did I cut her off at any time? You guys right. tell me in the chat. I you never cut not her rude off. To her at all. First I wasn't all, rude. I was sitting there like, bitch. Wow. This is Relax. my thing. She says I was. I was your mod, but I was her mod too, though, right? According what? to her, but you weren't. Let's exactly. not confuse saying, anybody because there's people. So, so, so you were too. not her mod. I was not. She said her you her were her mod. Exactly. She faked. That's how delusional is. She faked. So the lie came out mod. right there because at the end of the day, if in fact you had been Oops. her mod, it, not that it even makes any difference, but exactly. she said it right there by not saying it. She omitted you as her mod, even though that's what this beef was about because she was mad as you as a mod laughing at something that made her look silly. At exactly. the end of the day, her feelings were hurt that someone who maybe she respected laughed at something that made her feel silly because maybe she thought you were riding with her like some of the brainwash brigade that hangs out over in her chat. Yes, I said it. I said it's that. It's facts. Brainwash it's facts, brigade? okay? Yes, you said it uh, and it's facts, okay? Yes, it is. Yes, facts 100, okay? Um, absolutely. Um and look at my face. I'm like, my God, I just wanted to give a lesson on copyright. And look what happened over here. Um, another weird thing that happened, and I'm not trying to throw anyone under the bus, but everybody hears what they want to hear. Um, and this is a friend to the show, but this was weird. Um, only because, um, and maybe if you're here right now, the person who made this phone call, maybe now in hindsight, re-listening to this, because I think what was said and what was thought was heard was two different things. Um, because in between here, let me play this a little bit so you guys can hear, because when does she, when does this other person come on? This other person comes on at like 225-ish and we're at what, 217? So let's just see if we can make this go fast. Um, Oops, sorry. Just make sure, can you either um, make sure my bonnets are in the mail <laughs> and my turban and or refund me my money? Cause I mean, Storm, look, let me tell you something. I don't know you from a hole in the wall. I don't. I haven't called you any names and I don't know you. But what I do know is this, you reach out to me Okay, let I'm me just replay this it. just a little I'm bit. I'm going to continue to be on my channel. I'm going to continue to be Sister Chain. My storm chasers are going to continue to be there. You guys, I so, love all my storm chasers, but I'm not going to be attacked. You allow her to come on here, call me bitches, hoes, fat, ugly, storm, cut for 20,000 minutes. You storm, are bipartial. One. You are bipartial. That's your mod, and you know her. It's a one-sided uh, fight. How do I know storm? How do I know pineapples? I know you pineapples from my you cat. Just said that you were Look, that I'm pie uh, partial. Storm, that's my storm, I gave you. Did an I say that? Come on here. I don't care, and I'm saying what I have to say. Okay. I you never said I was off. partial because she's my mom. I was chaser. like, well, okay, Love that's you. what you want to say. Hi, my lovely people. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. Storm, um, just make sure. Can you either? Um, 
make sure my bonnets are in the mail <laughs> and my turban and or refund me my money because i mean storm look let me tell you something i don't know you from a hole in the wall i don't i haven't called you any names and i don't know you but what i do know is this you reached out to me when you were struggling to get to a thousand subscribers and you asked me for advice and i gave you some advice and i told you you didn't need my help right i told you you were doing good on your own did i not tell you that I have been nothing but nice to you. If an adult calls into my program and says what they want to say, we are not running a script over here. And Pineapples said what she had to say. This person in the chat, someone is saying, uh, Fran cannot control someone else's speech. That's Tina O. Um, Pink Bubblegum says, bruh, Fran really ain't even know Pineapples was going to talk about that how is that her fault okay um storm that was rude that's from sister girl uh moni says she was right to feel that way because fran you let her call her call her out straight disrespectful why in the world it's the entitlement for me at the end of the day i was minding my business someone had a beef they wanted to voice it on my channel i allowed it and they're an adult. It's language, guys. At the end of the day, calling someone bitch and calling them a thief. Thief is not a curse. Does that mean anything more to you because one's considered a cuss word and one isn't? At the end of the day, bitch, you steal both of them, okay? Is it better if someone just calls you a liar? Like, what? what is it that you want? Does it need to be, like, um, soft and gentle when someone uh talks to you a certain type of way like you can't control people's speech and you certainly can't control me you can't control pineapples so guys i just wanted you to know what happened right after and what i said because this also pays plays a key role in what happened storm had a narrative about these bonnets and these business transactions this bitch is money hungry and that's what it also boils down to too at the end of the day chelsea is in the hospital in critical condition nobody even knows you but what are you doing creating a gofundme who told you to do that are you her sister are you her mother are you her family why are you collecting money in someone's name that's not your right that's not your privilege but it's the entitlement for me okay what makes you think i owe you anything Pineapple's called with beef. I didn't even know what she was talking about. She's expressing herself. You got to express yourself. You cussed me the fuck out on Zola Band's platform. You called me a bitch. I didn't call you a bitch. I called you a bitch after you called me a bitch. I didn't call you a bitch. I was sitting there trying to talk to Zola Bands and Mr. Uh and Wolf. And you came and swooped in like you wanted to get one over on me. And I was like, you creep okay just notice that i am not censoring anybody if you want to stand up here and accuse me of allowing a grown-ass woman to speak well okay i did and if you don't like it i'm sorry i don't know what to tell you but if you want to pick fights out here on the youtube streets honey you're going to be uh shadow boxing you're going to be windmilling and you're going to be doing it out here on your own because, honey, boo boo, what I can tell you is this. I am not arguing and fighting with Nan, no one. You understand? And I gave you an opportunity to come up here and speak. You want Absolutely, to, Virgo doll. Like, it's all super of a sudden silly. make it my fault because Pineapples came through and she's a mod. Yeah, I don't take... Look, mod, mod is someone has a wrench in my chat. Um, I haven't had a moderator dinner party over here at my house. Um, to me, a mod... Um, yes, they hold a special place in this chat and it's someone who has been writing in my chat for Virgo, um, doll, this is the deal. Um, of course it's all silly. I mean, there are people out here going and filing police reports. I truly doubt that any of these people are ever going to darken my doorstep. And the one crazy one that does, I mean, that could be anybody, you know what I mean? Um, the bottom line is, is why are people beefing that don't know each other? This is stuff that happens all over the internet. This st is stuff that happens on every single sector. I promise you of YouTube, there's kind of no escaping it because people feel like people are subliminally 
talking to them and mental illness is real there are a lot of people out here who have um some sensitivities there are people out here who are just straight mentally ill and there are people out here who are jealous and ultra conservative and honestly there's a very few that have a little bit of all of those qualities and i think they call them narcissists okay and that is what's going on here I, I'm not beefing with nobody. I'm separating what's real from what's fake. Um, I think this is interesting because this has been going on a long time. And this has really changed some things in this community. And if, again, at the beginning, if you came in on time uh, when this started, not even so much on time, if you came in when this started, um, that's what I kind of prefaced this whole thing with. This is how quickly a lot of these feuds can get started on YouTube. But let me just, this is from a, uh, a, a subscriber perspective. I just want to play this because honestly, I have not played this, but I remembered this phone call and it kind of made me feel bad because this person made me feel like I was doing one of these up here and down there. And what I want to say to this is that Storm has had a narrative about me that i am running this thing of that i'm better um storm likes to play up to the downtrodden and people who feel maybe um that they need to um i don't know dumb themselves down in many ways and there's people out here who feel like because I celebrate success, because I celebrate you did your damn thing, you got a promotion, you're going to school, you're working two jobs, you're accomplishing things, bitch just bought a house, all of those things, that there's something wrong with me because I do that, that I put money and status over everything else. No, I'm celebrating as a woman working hard because for a long time, women you know, we're not celebrated for doing those things. We were downed for doing those things. And if you can do that, whether it's in your relationship, outside of your relationship, uh, as a couple, all of those things, there's nothing wrong with accomplishing things and, and celebrating your successes. Don't people go out to dinner after they get a promotion? Aren't people happy when they're making more money because they can take their kids on vacation now? Aren't people happy because you're not scrimping to pay rent and maybe you're saving to put money down on a house? Why is that a bad thing? Why am I a bad person because I carry a designer bag? Why am I a bad person because I'm happy and proud to be married? Why is it like it's okay for you to not agree with those things it's okay for you to not be feminine it's okay for you to not be um a heterosexual i don't care if you're a lesbian um just because you're a lesbian and you think it's wonderful doesn't mean that i want to be like the the overtones and the just because i'm not that you must be this i never say that let me tell you there's a lot of people who've gone from zero to hero okay and i mean in terms of yeah we're never going to be broke again or i i was raised and we didn't have enough food but i'm not going to raise my kids like that i mean there's a lot of people who are very happy and proud that they've come from one place in life to another and that doesn't mean that we're downing that other place in life we are celebrating our place or celebrating where somebody wants to be why is that so intimidating but i'm telling you the unsuccessful the unfulfilled and the unhappy women on this youtube are always going to come for the necks of the women that are and i don't care if you got two nickels to rub together 20k to rub together or you're a damn millionaire okay that group over there with storm they like to point the fingers at the bitches who are doing something whether it's on their level or not and make it seem like we're bad people because we're celebrating successes in life what i i don't think it's cool to sit around and um ask each other for 20 and 30 dollars all the time if you want to cash at me because you're enjoying this content please do i certainly believe in tipping the host but i don't need you to tip me you can tip me because you appreciate what the fuck I'm doing up here. How I stepped out and I'm doing what I do. 
that's not me dry begging that's me opening my mouth and telling you what is really going on but there was a whole agenda going on and we really didn't see it and at the end of the day you guys do what you want to do i'm still over here doing what i do and that's number one minding my business number two creating my content and not falling for stupid bullshit. but and this is a person who is welcome in this chat don't get this wrong but you called in and we're just going to talk about it so don't take it personal it is what it is we're because, just we're doing um, a reaction that, that's okay? not what makes you okay it shouldn't but if that's what makes you that's your problem not mine anyway guys i don't want to talk about this anymore this is like this is low energy vibrational bs and i probably knew better that i shouldn't have let anyone else on um pineapples came through and she wanted to make an announcement she had something to say people feel threatened by that and it is what it is you know what i'm saying like i guess if you can't cash the checks don't write them okay so if you want to talk about people behind their backs okay understand that if that's what you did and that's what you're doing and people are dropping tea on you then it is what it is you know what i'm saying um don't write checks your ass can't cash okay Bloop. all right and that's and that's youtube streets 101 that's not okay. just oh my pineapples god and storm drama pineapples that what do you got to say hon youtube streets if you want to talk your shit so, you want to pop your shit? Understand, it's going to get popped and it's going to come back to you. Okay, all right. So, okay, so, all right. We'll I'm be back say, another uh, time yeah, um, to finish oh, up I'm this gonna, lesson. Wait, let me because, put it on. Yeah, I'm at. I'm. Okay. I'm over here. Okay, Hattie Hawkins. All right, put your. Go ahead. All right. So, first of all, I want to say that everything I state is facts. So you can't say it that I said anything and that I don't have the screenshot to back the shit up. So the first thing I'm going to start off with, at that time when Storm came for me, she said that um, people were jealous of her. Well, bitch, no. I had 3.520 huh, 3. subscribers and she had 2,000. That's the first motherfucking thing. So, bitch, you thought she was the clout, but bitch, I was the motherfucking clout. So that's the first thing. See, bitches don't like the way I talk. But, bitch, if you come over here to get checked, I'm going to check that ass. So well, certain people too. have been, they've been clocking how you talk and they, and they kind of are repeating your playbook. I see this girl. I see that. Oh, oh, oh thank you, friend. Thank you, okay. friend, for noticing they, they it. They took your playbook like they and they, and because they, now she's her. saying all the bitches and hoes, she can fit in there. Bye -bye. Exactly. So she said that, that people were mad because she got super chats. Bitch, I wasn't in your chat to know that your big ass got a super chat. That's number one. Number two, I was never a mod. Number three, I never received a gift card from nobody in the world. Okay. Number four. Well, if she I sent it to New Jersey, we know you five, didn't get five. it because that's not where that it, girl. Thank, she got it all wrong. It, thank you. She said I had a PO box. I don't have a PO box. Number number four. Number five. I don't live in Jersey, bitch. Do your do your motherfucking get a history check. I was never a mod. Okay, and also. Mods are not your baby mother, okay? Right. So that's what I have to say to that. All right. So this last little bit we're gonna play, guys. If you want to watch this, be my guest. But listen, listen to this part. This was a little. This we'll talk about after. Okay, just one second, Boo Boo. I was. This was the. We're gonna pile on. Hold on, Hattie. One second. Bad. My dog is barking. Hold on. Patty Hawkins, what's going on? Hey, how you doing? How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. I mean, this is this is uh, it's it it was a little bit of a shit show. I mean, I I was in the middle of of trying to help you guys learn about channel strikes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I have a question for you. So Miss Storm came on and Pineapples came on. I watched all of y'all's channels, and you know, but. I'm not understanding, like, she didn't call in and cut you out, so I don't understand. She said that I was being one-sided. She said that I'm going to... So you guys saw the whole conversation. I played parts back. Do you see the diversions that happen sometimes? 
So right now I'm being called out by one of you guys, not one of you in the chat right now. Maybe you're in the chat. I don't know. And I don't have any hard feelings, but when you watch something in the moment, you got to be careful guys, because sometimes we're watching stuff in the moment and you play it back and you realize it wasn't as bad as you thought, or maybe it is worse than what you thought. Can I get a witness on that? Um, I did not yell at her. I did not clown on her. But someone from the chat calls in and now is now accusing me on top of it of being a bad person. Do we not see this? Sorry for pineapples. She gave me no opportunity to ask her any questions. She made up her mind and she said what she said. Now, I, I'm not in control of pineapples now. If pineapples said what she said, I mean, I have no relationship with Storm. Storm emailed me for help once upon a time, and I gave her the help that I thought she needed. I went and looked at her channel. I saw that she was doing very well, and I told her she didn't need my help. I said, you're going to be monetized before you know it, and she was monetized two weeks later. She was stressing about being monetized, and I gave her some encouragement to tell her, it looks like you're doing a pretty good deal. And I've got already. receipts on that okay? email I Most sent people her. don't even answer these emails, okay? Secondly, I supported her business by placing an order for myself and as a giveaway for two other people. And she comes here and accuses me of not being fair, of a situation I know nothing about because I wasn't watching her channel last night. And it's not to be shady. I was watching Toya. That's someone whose channel I've been watching before I ever even knew about Storm. You know what I'm saying? It's not to be shady when I say I wasn't watching someone. It's I was watching what I was watching. Like dro okay. videos are dropping constantly on YouTube. You can't assume just because people are subscribed to you that they're going to drop what they're doing every single time. Like Hattie, if I drop a video and Storm drops a video, you think I'm going to be mad because you go to Storm's first? I'm just going to yeah. ask you when you get some time, come through. You know what I'm saying? And, yeah. if, and if you feel a way about what happened between me and Storm, I'm not going to be mad because you're over there in her chat. I'm just going to ask you that if you oh, are over there you, and course. you're and yeah. not you, but whoever wants to run some shit talk on me, do yourself a favor and don't come to my chat because what's going to happen is my chat's going to rip you apart and then it's going to be my fault. You know what I'm saying? Like you can't expect to talk about people behind their back and expect for people not to find out when you are in the messy fucking fucking section section of the YouTube streets. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like if yeah. you're in the messy section and you're being messy and someone takes your mess to someone else and they come and confront you on it, now you're mad? Like come on now, don't be like don't be silly. And I'm meaning this with you in all due respect, Hattie, because I appreciate you calling and asking this question because it puts the subscribers see what i'm gonna do right now hattie and I, I really appreciate you doing this because what happens is is that by storm storm has been this is my observation okay this is my observation for the past couple of days mm -hmm. i see people kind of trying to put some lines down to say like if you're here you shouldn't be there if you're there you shouldn't be here what right. I, and you've said it before, if you know, you watch who you want to watch, it's YouTube, you know, I understand that. I just, I just, it's crazy to me how, you know, and with talking to you, I can see you felt some kind of way with her saying that you were picking a side. Right, I, I, I actually I really did storm. I wouldn't have let her come up. If I would have been right. like, ish, I, I'm not talking to you. I don't have nothing. I'm riding 150. Like, like exactly. Can you is, is can you guys relate to that? I don't talk to people I don't fuck with. Honestly, guys, you guys know I rarely let people up on this panel, period. The fact that I let her up, I thought we could have a conversation. Um, if I really was being one-sided, I would have been like, not on your life. If Quinn or Jackie came through, that would never have happened because they would never have come up to my panel. Storm can't stick her pinky toe on my panel at this moment. Okay? Period. Ever. Forget about this moment. Ever. And I'm kind of, you know what I mean? Like, this call, I'm not going to lie, really annoyed me because I think that 
I don't know. I almost feel like she was put up to doing this for whatever reason. Maybe this is truly how you felt. And you're welcome to come back and talk to me about this if you ever like to. But at the bottom line is, of course, when someone tells you that you're being biased, I could have said, well, I think you're being biased right now. Like you are asking questions that are putting me in a bad light. But the person who actually was doing the doing, it's all OK. Pineapples, what do you think about that? Well, that happens a lot. I see when, see, I feel like they know how to clock in and defend this bitch like nobody else. There you go. But see, through all her lies, everything come out the bitch mouth. Is a guy. It's like you get a merit badge over there for um for capping for this bitch. It's like you get a capping. It's like just do they get a cap badge? Like, is it like the Girl Scouts over there, the sister chain? You get like a blue cap for going in there and trying to rescue that hoe. They must be receiving gift cards, okay? Oh, it's gift That's the it's ten dollars, or I maybe mean. they're getting paid through Cash App. I don't know. Oh, maybe negative okay. vibes is paying them in Cash App. I don't know what okay. the fuck's going on over there, but I don't want no parts of it, and I don't yeah. want no parts of nobody that was so mad at mm-hmm. me for telling the goddamn truth. Yeah, Her. I think that that's crazy. I think it's crazy. Um, I just want you guys to see this is how this played out. And if you notice and if you watch carefully, this is how it played out probably five or six more times across the YouTube streets. This was a rinse and repeat over and over and over again. Pine, did I cut you off, hon? No, no, you are exactly right. It's the same thing. Go in, make up some stories. At one percent of the truth, ninety nine percent lies, and then find somebody else. Go in, same shit over and over. A mess, okay, guys. If we cannot acknowledge, we cannot see the behavior. You're not gonna be it when you see this happening. Girl, say something, do something. I don't know. Do what you want. Pineapples is a awesome creator. Uh, Pineapples uh, called in and I respect Pineapple. And as, out of respect, I gave uh, Storm an opportunity. And yeah, I don't know Storm like I know Pineapples, but I really don't know Pineapples like super well. I mean, she, she hasn't been to my house for Easter. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, I know her as much as I know Blama. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know her from these YouTube streets. But right. as far as uh, Storm, me and Storm just started dealing with each other. With each other. I just gave her. Look at this positive vibes was in my chat. Chris, and I, I wanted to support her business, so I ordered a couple of bonnets for myself and my daughter. Do you see? Do you see the and smear, my daughter? And then I said, "Well, maybe- do you see the smear campaign starting in here? I'm a storm chaser, and that was not far. I guess they meant to say fair." at all how you did that Fran and you know that okay what yeah, did I do on feelings in my facts. right right after this happened this was a sh- it was just a mess after that I Fran did not pick a side that conversation she was listening you see how yeah this was maybe this was I'll crazy give away through her site and that was it you know what I'm saying like for you to think just because all of a sudden I placed an order on your site, like we're Ace Boon Coon, I mean, that is not necessarily the case, but I'm trying to give you an opportunity to express yourself. Like you can't come through here and express and think that you're gonna like run me. Right. I earned this. This is my platform. I earned this. Like I sit here because this is what I put together, not because you think you're coming through and we're all of a sudden like, That's I right. owe you something. Right. You, and you come see, to my that, house, you show me some fucking respect. You know what I'm saying? I Period. Do. And see, the thing is, like, from me, from my aspect, uh, as the bet- viewer's aspect, you know, you started off by watching the three moms and wanted to share your opinion on it. And in, you know, some people that view it, you know, like you say, Jasmine has these people that are just, oh, you're a good mom. You know, you're a good mom that are delusional. You know what I mean? So in, I can see their aspect. Those people that um, are being said that are delusional, they may have um, 
they may have been watching her channel from the very get go. So they feel like there is a connection, you know, just like when you started YouTube, you may have felt some kind of like, okay, let's see what they're up to. You know what I mean? Not a connection where, you know, I'm going to go run the streets with them or whatever, but you felt with the people you watch, you feel like some kind of connection or you are learning from them or mm -hmm. somewhat. So I think Storm is still new to the YouTube and, you know, well, I would, so expect, she feels I would say like don't that pick connection, fights. That's right. social number one, stop picking fights. Well, I mean, and I'm not here to defend anybody because, you know, I watch all no, of you. No, I'm, I'm not saying you know you what I mean? pick your fight, honey. I'm saying, <laughs> but, like, if you want to be on this, look, I mean, I, I mean, I get what you're saying, Hattie, like, as far as, um, I mean, look, I, this is not about me. This is about No, Storm. it's not. And this I think what mind. happened was let's, let's, it was just a break of communication I, or something. You, no, I mean, before this today, you know what I mean? Between Storm okay. and Pineapples, you yeah. know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And it definitely, it could have definitely happened off the screen where people aren't dropping uh, videos uh, to say somebody you know what I mean but I think that's the YouTube way I guess but it when and I, like I said I think Storm is still kind of new so her feelings are probably more attached to you know um, her I, subscribers Patty, or whatever. excuse me for just a second real talk you don't know what I was dismissing you're sitting there and I'm sitting here no 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 um, I'm not no. saying you're dismissing, well, Hattie, you're dismissing anything no Hattie I was saying to real talk this is oh, someone real talk in the chat, not not like girl real talk. No, someone named Real Talk is in the chat is saying that I automatically said that Storm didn't give pineapples a chance to talk. What I meant by that, and um, and I am snarky. Do better. Thank you. I'm very snarky. If you didn't know that and you're new here, welcome. Um, I am snarky and was snarky, is snarky, will be snarky. If you are not familiar with my content, this is nothing new. Now to real talk, um, what I said was this, if the chat is gone, if you had a problem with pineapples and you did not let her speak, coming from the perspective of I was not there and I did not see it, how can I dismiss something I did not see? I said, if, if in fact, and you know, this is, this is gonna be posted. So you guys go back, slice it, dice it, dissect it study it whatever you think you want to do at the end of the day the bottom line is is that pineapples called in unbeknownst to me she dropped that she is upset with storm what the fuck do you think i'm supposed to do ma'am not you hattie um real talk i'm i'm listening and now all of a sudden i'm in the middle of something or feel like i'm in the middle because i am not in the middle i don't i don't know storm I know Storm from an email. I know Storm from doing a transaction. And I know Storm from giving her big up on the videos that she dropped a week or two ago. And all of those were positive interactions. And excuse the hell out of me for supporting somebody and giving them some encouragement to move forward with their channel. Excuse the fuck out of me for supporting someone's business. And excuse me for giving someone an opportunity to speak on a platform that is bigger than theirs. Okay. Oops. Nobody ever did and I, that oops. for me. And it's certainly not crazy. They sure did. And I never had anyone do that for me. I understand. wish I would have had a YouTuber send me if some this advice. This is the way you act. Free advice. Understand <laughs> that people will make note of this. And yeah, girl, you got your whole own platform. So I suggest next time you have a message to clear up for someone that you've been running your mouth about, why don't you get back on your platform and do it? I gave you an opportunity and you're trying to flip it on me, girl, you go right on ahead. But at the end of the day, yeah, you can't, you, you're not running anything over here. So Hattie, let me let you, um, let me let you get the rest of your comment out and we're going to shut this down. Cause honestly, I didn't even intend to be on this long. This is like two and a half hours. And, um, you know what I'm saying? Like this is, uh, this is not the direction that this needed to go in because this is not the, um, you know, this is this is this isn't the business. That was it. I just wanted to get your aspect because you know, yeah. And talking with you, you know, I see. But I I was kind of thrown for a loop when you were like, "Girl, uh, you know, 
run me my shit or okay, right, okay. Me my shit. wait you know, can we can we talk about that for a second hattie you were out of order on that hattie I know this is water under the bridge, but I never said run me my shit. You guys saw how I said it. I said that's exactly the part that I wanted to replay. This is what happens on YouTube, guys. Okay. So Storm and I hang up. Now you see from the from the chat room, I'm not saying it, look from the chat. This is how you guys hear things. So Hattie just said. I said, run me my shit. This is what I said. Okay. Can we get this clear? Milling and you're going to be doing it out here on your own. Cause honey, boo boo. What I can tell you is this. I am not arguing with subscribers and you asked me for advice and I gave you some advice. Ho. That. Ugly storm. You are bipartial. You are bipartial. That's your mod, and you know her. It's a one sided fight. Uh, how do I know storm? How do I, I know pineapples? pineapples? I know you pineapples from my you chat. Just said that you were. Look, that I'm bipartial. Uh, storm, that's my storm, mod. It's like you can't even speak to this woman. I don't care. And I'm saying what I have to say. Okay. You can cut me off. See you, storm chasers. Love you. Hi, my lovely people. All right, guys. Storm, um, just make sure. Can you either um, make sure my bonnets are in the mail <laughs> and my turban, and or refund me my money? Because I mean, Storm, look. Let me tell you something. I don't know you from a hole in the wall. I don't. I haven't called you any names. And did I say run me my shit? Did I say that? I said if the if my stuff is in the mail. Fine. If not, okay. All right. I'm done. Pineapples, can you give us some closing words? Um, what do you, what are your thoughts on all this? This is this is all some telephone talk. This is all I, what I think I thought I heard. This is all just some lazy gossip. Because at the end of the day, um, I'm not mad at anybody. I'm gonna tell you this too. And I did get a note from the YouTube streets today. Uh, not today, excuse me. I did get a note from the YouTube streets. I've actually gotten a couple. And I'm not going to say any names. Um, you know who you are. At the end of the day, I don't... One person I've not spoken with, one person I, I talked a little bit in email. At the end of the day, the bottom line is, is that there are people who may have some regrets. There are some people who may feel like I was mistreated. I'm sure there's people out here pineapples who may feel the same way about you i don't know if you get those notes or not we didn't talk about that today but i've gotten two this week okay um i've had people in the past come through and say you know i misjudged you i'm so sorry whatever um i'm here to put up content i have a youtube channel that i love i've got a youtube situation i love okay um with three channels and I love doing content. It feeds a creative side of me that I really, really, really love. I love talking to all you guys. I love telling stories, sharing my story, talking about other people who share their stories, right? Um, it, when that gets interrupted, it's very frustrating. And when people try to do a snatch and grab on you, it's it's shocking. Um, I don't I don't have a problem with anyone watching whatever that because i watch whatever i want at the end of the day um if you make a declaration understand when you're making declarations you just have to deal with the bullshit there's no reason why anyone who decides to stop watching me today needs to send me a note to tell me why you're stopped watching me and then six months from now want to apologize and say hey i'm back we are you're watching my channel it is okay if it runs that deep for you i i don't know what to tell you um, but I do have feelings and understand when you hurt, when you, when you, you know, it doesn't run. Look, it's just different for me. But at the end of the day, if you left, you want to come back. The doors of the chat are open. If you feel like you left a way that you feel a way, think, think about what you need to do to come back or not come back. I mean, I'm not stopping no shows. If people in the chat start asking you questions, that's your business. I don't know what to tell you. 
these are this is your the chat this is you guys chat okay i just manage it because this is my channel but this chat belongs to you guys if you decide to get up and leave that's your business but you don't have to make it my business by sending me a i declare i will no longer deal with you again like i don't uh, 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 <laughs> I, it's okay well, Bye, for, and all I wanted to say was for all those who pretended as though it was a miscommunication, for people who said, oh, no, I hope they can work. It wasn't shit to work out. You told they lie. I checked your ass and the shit is over, period. Mm -hmm. So if you don't like it, too bad, too bad. When somebody check, when somebody come for you, let's see how you're going to react. Are you just going to mm -hmm. let people lie on you and make up fake ass videos about you? I don't think so. Of course not. So people want to make pretend like it was a beef. It was not a beef. Somebody asked for it and they got that shit. So that's what it was. It's crazy. You can so call I it a tomato. You know what I'm saying? Call it a tomato if that makes it like whatever it is, whatever it wasn't. Just just pretend that you're at your job and someone from the next department over decided to say that you stole someone's work or that you were rude to them in a meeting. Karen, Karen came out the bushes at your job and said you yelled at her coming out the bathroom. And now you're sitting in your boss's office getting written up for poor communication skills. Look at it like that. OK, and then see how you feel when you have to go and defend yourself and how you feel when you see Karen the next time in the cafeteria, when you go to go get your coffee at three o'clock. OK, look at it like that. Right, and another thing that was was another lie. Oh, it was a troll. No, it was not a troll. It was a lie. Okay, the bitch is delusional. It was it was a diversion. Period. It was a diversion and distraction. She wanted a way to get at Keisha, um, and get at you. She was mad. She wasn't happy, and I think that um, I, I'm not really sure what the deal was. Um, but she was, it was a diversion to ta tactic and, it, and it's unfortunate, but, um, you know, I, I think that what's come out has needed to come out. And I think that she, um, everyone should know what they need to know and everyone feels how they want to feel. And, and, and we're just going to probably just let this go and move on because honestly, um, but you know, it's not, it's not all gone at the end of the day, if you know my thing is this it, it's gonna go away for as long as it goes away if someone wants to dig this back up and continue to dig it back up i guess that's gonna just be on them but i i hope not um but don't think i'm not gonna answer like you know i will i will respond if i need to but otherwise it's kind of like we're like we're good over here Right, Fran, we're just reminiscing and kind of giving people a backstory on how right. we got to be up to yeah. now. Absolutely. And where all the shit began, you know? Absolutely. Okay, so look, um, you guys have a good evening. I think this was an interesting exercise. We're going to do something else um, soon again, guys. Maybe do another reaction. Um, but yeah, for a lot of you who have asked, because a lot of you have, what happened, how this gets started, um, it's interesting to kind of go back and see what had happened was um, six months ago when we, um, when this was all kind of a little bit new and someone came out uh, super duper crazy <laughs> on these YouTube streets, uh, causing mayhem and confusion pretty much wherever they went. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Can you guys give pineapples some pineapples in the chat, please? And um, tell her thank you for dropping by today and um, sharing some time with us. Girl, what happened to your picture? Have you not been on StreamYard that long that you lost your picture, your Girl, avatar? I don't know why it didn't let my picture in there this time. I don't mm -hmm. know what that happened. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. All right, well, um, lady... Thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you, friend. I appreciate it. I'm glad I got to come back and it wasn't, you know, negative energy this time. Of course. Yeah. I mean, we are definitely, uh, you know, this is a whole different situation. I mean, look, I, th I think 20 hindsight is 2020 
and sometimes it's uh you know i don't know i think when you get this this the stunner of a of a surprise attack it it's it's like oh my god but um we know who we're dealing with so it's not a surprise anymore and um girl just get back to doing your content leave people alone right and if i, I, I am your content I'm okay everybody's doing their content right stay in your own lane and stop bothering me. That's all. yeah just stop bothering people can you just can we all just agree we just stop bothering people i mean look a lot of us do reaction videos but we don't have to dox people you don't have to like send notes to people's houses uh leave the children out of it like can we follow some of the etiquette okay on the youtube streets if there if there is such a thing can we use a little decorum if there's any etiquette left can we just you use know, the golden rule? a certain set of rules if everybody stayed within their certain guide within the guidelines then we wouldn't have all this doxing going on right right um okay um absolutely fifi look i don't know um if this message i don't know who this message is from nah she needs to she does she needs to grow up and get a life absolutely mickey you got that right um storm don't forget to hit the like button on your way out thank you for the watch time <laughs> all of the people all of the people in the bushes thank you bushes i sir i appreciate it so much you guys thank you thank you thank you um, anyway, I'm going to let you go, Pineapples. Thank you so much. We're going to do this again soon. We're going to react to something else, okay? Okay, friend. Thanks so much for having me. Pineapple. Bye, friend. Bye, Chad. Take care, hon. Thank you. All right. Okay, bye-bye. Okay. Bougie Gang, thank you for giving Pineapples her flowers, which were Pineapples in the chat. You guys are amazing, as usual. This was just a little special something, something, something. I just, you know, with all this BS going on, I'm sorry. I had to, I had to clear this up. I had to. Um, but at the end of the day, you guys are amazing. And I appreciate all of you guys. Um, thank you for coming. And um, we will see you again the next time. Okay. Uh hey guys, I hope that you enjoyed this reaction rebroadcast from October 21st, where Pineapples and I reacted to uh, a video that was from maybe six months before both videos will be in the description box if you want to go check out like the original original or the original reaction um but i thought this was worth playing again i thought it was so funny and um pineapples is so much fun to react with so um i just knew you guys would love it because um we love pineapples over here at the bougie gang gang she is bougie gang gang all day so anyway guys don't forget to thumbs up this video and share it share it share it otherwise i will see you tomorrow have a good day bye bye
Welcome to Love, Lies, and Lace, friends, where we do reactions, reviews, and commentary on the YouTube channels you love to watch. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notifications so you can be notified every time I go live.